Okay, so the reason that you're here is that you want to get rid of this boring interface of Windows 11 and you want to kind of customize it to this new version by installing some free tools. So throughout this video, I'm going to let you know how you can do this step by step with all the process installation process. But before that, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Please leave a positive comment down there below. I mean, I need your support so much. So without any further ado, let's get into that. Okay, okay, so first off, we want to open this website called rockstanister.com, right? We want to get into this website and click on Lively Wallpaper. Okay, and then scroll down like all the way down to the bottom of the site. And at this point, you've got two different choices, either to download this application from Microsoft Store, or you can alternatively download the installer from directly from the website itself. Okay, so I suggest you to download the installer. I've already, in that case, downloaded the installer. Okay, first impression coming through. Okay, so this is the application. We've got different wallpapers from Matrix, Matrix Rain, customizable like if you're a coder if you like an app developer you might want to use this version and protein clouds oh god what is this protein clouds oh my god i'm not getting i'm not getting good ideas i don't know <laughs> rain oh this is fine as hell this is a great one right and by moving your mouse cursor, you can see that it will like kind of float around. This one is a great one. Triangle and line. Okay, this is cool, but not my taste. What else? Music, TV. No signal. Okay, because I'm not playing any song. I don't want to get copyrighted. Living room. Okay, no signal again. I don't know how I can give this TV a signal. But for the sake of this tutorial, I'm gonna just select rain because I thought it's kind of classy and not too harsh. The movement is all fine. Kind of like it. So this was the first application. So the second application that you want to consider installing the second app let's open the website again the second one you have to open github and install it through github to get rounded toolbar to change your toolbar into a rounded shape i've already downloaded this in order to download this you just need to click on like the link in front of latest in this case the this update has more features blah 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 and then scroll down to the zip file, right? Not the source code of it. Okay, okay, around the TV, double click on it. Nothing changed. Show rounded TV. Okay, so you can customize it in your own favor. Okay, so this is the second application. I'm not the biggest advocate and like the biggest fan of it because it reduces a lot of functionality of your windows. But if you just want to all in into looks, it might be a good idea to install this one. Let's get into the next one. We're just gonna open this website to install this app called Rain Meter. You can either Google it or just copy and paste the, uh, I mean, the link, it's such a famous app. Okay, I'm gonna head over and install it real fast. The cool part is the additional skins that you can add inside this application called Rain Meter. So these are three different skins, which I found really cool. So I'm gonna head over and paste all of these skins links. And all the links are down there in the description as well. You can enjoy and download. Okay. MII power. Okay, just by clicking on the skin when you downloaded it, the application, the rain meter would will automatically open it. So you just wanna click on install and you got to be good, right? Let's 
install, download and install the second app. Mond rain meter theme. Okay, and then download 1.9 megabytes. All right. Okay, click. And then, okay, install. Oh God, okay, okay, okay. Things getting interesting. Language, English, translate. Don't need to translate anything. Okay. This is cool. We're just gonna close this for now. And let's head over and install the most amazing skin, which is called Montre Rain Meter. You can kinda add Mac widgets inside your Windows 11 with this skin of Rain Meter application. I mean, this is incredible. Okay, so we're just gonna download it, click on it, and then Montre, okay. Click on it. Okay, bro, I'm not gonna lie, I'm so excited for this one specifically. Hit on install. Okay, okay. Bro, this is cool. The weather app. And you can also change the look of it. Wide, large, medium, and small. Okay, I'll take it. Notes. I don't think I'll need that. Music. Yes, thank you. Volume. Bro, this is like a mixer, volume mixer inside Windows. You can change it in real time. Headphones. Okay. Got some sort of animation as well. Okay. And timer. So you can change the looks of it from blur to a solid color and automatically due to your uh, window settings dark and of course light okay and then after you've made all the changes of widgets inside rain meter application what do you want to do is that you just want to open the main manager rain meter window and then get into settings section you just want to click on disable dragging okay by checking disable dragging and then close these widgets cannot be dragged no more exactly how you want it to be and let me just tell you that these applications, both Lively Wallpaper and Rain Meter, they will just use very minimal of your PC resources. I am personally playing Overwatch, not competitively, but I'll try my best to play with my friends in 240 frames per second, and it has no effect on my experience. And I'll definitely suggest you to install these widgets in long-term use. Please like this video if you find any value, subscribe to my channel, leave a positive comment. It all means a lot to me. And take care of yourself and see you in the next one.